hello guys today we will solve lead code problem 334 so here we have given one array in that we have to find a triplet such that i is greater than j is greater than k is, is a valid you know so uh, here we have you know first of all if we want to do this thing using brute force then we can start from the last element and then we can count for uh, for five is there any element is less than five then we can also you know check further further if it is less than or equal to five or not and uh, like that we can solve you know this problem using brute force and that our time complexity will be of n square because first of all we have to you know uh, run for five then if it is like your three then we will increase the count then also we, we will do the same thing here also so like that now the second here our constraint is is uh, 5 into 10 to the power 5 so we have to solve this problem is 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 in of and time complexity so first of all uh, like here if we start from the one then uh, we have to get two elements that are greater than one like two and three so for that we have one algorithm like we can write a simple algorithm let's assume we have two number first and second because we want to get two more numbers if we have one then we want to get two and three so our both numbers will be very big you know and i will tell you these things why these numbers are very big so float of infinity and now we'll run a for loop in our our number list so nums here here first of all we have to get the first number so if our first number is less than equal to our i in that scenario our first number will be i so now let's assume if we get one year then our first number will change here in two also our first number will change in three also our first number will change four five okay but if if we got our first number for one so now our first number will not change because you know this is the minimum value that we can get for the first value like that for second value also here we have else if condition if our second is less than equal to i in that scenario also our second number will be i so uh, like for first number we have to get the minimum number and the for second number also we have to get the you know, second minimum number and like here now our first is one second is two so now if now if we get any number that is you know greater than first and second then that is you know here we get a triplet so we have to return return true and if we didn't get any any output there then we have to return false so basically first of all we have to get the minimum value so whenever we starting from here like here here we we got two one first of all two so now our one is smaller than two then we are uh, you know now our first is one and second is the second uh, didn't sense till now because five is is you know it is not less than uh, our yeah so here like our second will change then here this zero is less than our first so now it will change here here also our second is you know four is less than five so it will change it and then for six it will return true so like that this algorithm will work now let's try to some uh, run this code okay here we got some error so first second floor float for i in nums if i is less than equal to if second is less than else if in the else we will return true otherwise we will return for uh, it, it it is right solution but currently it is not working i think we have to remove this thing if it is less than equal to okay go back 
if f less than equal to i then f is equal to i if else if is s less than equal to i yeah it is it is right answer but it is not working currently i cannot understand why it is not working Give me one second. Let me go to our solution. Not solution submission actually here. So first if I oh okay okay we did a very big mistake actually. Here we have to compare with I. If I is less than equal to our F, then we have to change it. Sorry, I did a very big mistake here now run it yeah it is working perfectly fine and now submit it as you can see that it is running perfectly fine there is no problem so like that we can solve this problem in off and time complexity and if you face any you know difficulty in this solution then you can comment below thank you for watching this video